The Secure Transactions in Movable Assets Act was passed into law in 2017 to address the thorny issue of accessibility to loans by the MSMEs. After its passage, securing loans with movable assets has not been any way better because not all financial institutions trust movable assets as collateral to get loans. So one of the issues that we had, or one of the feedback that we were getting, was that how would the judicial system support them in case a loan goes bad? So they want confidence in the, in the judiciary to back them up. See, and the judiciary has a very clear role in the STMA Act. But how many small business owners know about the Act and that movable assets like cars, electrical appliances and others can be used as collateral? The small businesses all over the place, they don't have that security to offer the banks. So, but they have cars, they have equipment that can be used as collateral. So all you need to do is walk into your financial institution and say you want a loan and this is the collateral you have. But for the Attorneys General under the auspices of the Conference of Western Attorneys General, they say public education on the Act will go a long way. We need greater public education first and foremost, that, they, that there's a national uh, collateral registry. I think that it's very important for the public. We just have an Act that is telling us that this one is the way to go. But maybe with time, we will get to that level where we will now have a grandiose code for commercial transactions that will regulate. You know, because they, are, they, they, they could be subject to abuse. CWAG is optimistic that the Secure Transactions and Movable Assets Act will bring a resultant boost to MSMEs by strengthening movable assets legally. Mutipo Oluwa, Shiremeko, STV News.